Frontier has been around for 86 years. We are the largest provider of telecommunication services to rural America and suburban America. So if you think about it, we are in 28 states, over 30,000 communities nationwide. And most of those communities are small. We have 16,400 great employees. We have a 100% US-based workforce, so we have no jobs overseas and 13% of our workforce are veterans or reservists. We are very pleased to be in the business we're in because we know that the people who decide to live in smaller communities deserve the same type of telecommunication services as the big cities. We have a simple philosophy at Frontier. It's called the three Ps, people, product, and then profit. So if we take great care of our people, our employees, by developing them, training them, and giving them the tools, they in turn will deliver great products to our customers and our customers see that value and in turn pay us for those services. We've kept it simple for 10 years that I've been CEO of the company and we continue to keep that vital few focus throughout the entire organization. I think stewardship is about greater good. It's about doing something not just to get it done, but doing something to sustain an asset, uh, an organization, a capability for the long run. When I think about the viability of rural America, one of the most important aspects of that is making sure they have healthy economies. And that economic development is about supporting businesses and education systems within the rural communities to make sure that we have great talent, that businesses can flourish, whether they're existing businesses or new businesses can start, and so economic development is sort of the heartbeat of making sure there's prosperity around the country. After traveling to many rural markets over these last 10 years, whenever I come back from those trips, I always uh, take pause for thought and say how lucky we are to work in these markets and to serve these markets. And I sat back and I said, you know, if you can put a contest in place, that has sustainability and longevity as an outcome of economic development and improving lifestyles in rural America as our end game. And we could put up, say, $10 million in prize money. The multiplier effect could be $100 or $200 million for all of these communities. I said, okay, we need to get a couple other partners to work with us. Frontier put up the uh, initial $5 million for this prize. I went to the Dish Network, which is one of our partners, and I also went to CoBank. We collectively came together and said, this is a good idea. Let's do this together. Let's be the premier sponsors of this America Best Community program and do a $10 million contest that would take place over a two and a half year window that would really encourage communities in these 28 states to put a plan in place for economic development and improve lifestyle and livelihood and then implement that plan. I'm so thrilled today that we've launched this program. There are no losers in this contest. We are going to share all of the best practices, the innovations and the ideas across all of the markets that we serve. So we do know that a rising tide can lift all boats.